I want to introduce you guys to actor, writer, and producer Manny Perez. I never knew my father, but he was the love of my mother's life. I made you mine, didn't I? Right, Junior? And the night I was born, he died. Look, I have a kid coming. Still up my mother's ass? Huh? Talk to me. Can you put in a cold base? By 1975, Hector had recorded 12 albums. He has seven number one hits. Madison Square Garden. He filled that place up like that. Hector was the biggest. He had it all. He had everything. I got a chance to catch up with Manny at the Dominican Film Festival where he was being recognized for his contributions to film. Thank you so much, Manny. First, I want to thank you for this interview. I really appreciate that. Growing up, did you ever think that one day people would be honoring you for your work, for your accomplishments in film, and in, um, in, in producing and creating works? Uh, well, thank you for having me. No, never. Uh, never thought of this. Uh, no. So being here is a miracle, really. And I thank the Lord because I never Amen. really thought of this. I want to take you back to your time at Marymount, Marymount Manhattan College, which happens to be my alma mater, and I know it's yours as well. Okay. Take me back to that time. What was it like being a student there? Well, first of all, when I started, um, it was the second year they opened it up to uh, males, because it was mostly a female college. So I was happy. I was like, yeah, I'm the man in this one. But, um, but no, it was great. Uh, acting was my thing, so there's a, they have a great theater program. So I was just thrilled to be part of that. What Part kept you college. motivated after college? Like, what made you want to keep pursuing, um, you know, the acting world, the acting industry? I know that it can be difficult. Was it difficult for you to break in? Well, you know, I, I've always had the hunger. So, uh, till, this, till, till, till this day, I still feel like I need to do a lot more to get where I have to get. So, it's all about building your hunger and feeding your hunger. And that's how, I, you know, I, I never really thought that I would drop out of this. Wow. And I don't. Gotcha. You've done films like Pride and Glory, Illegal Tender, El Cantante, um, and those are all beautiful Hollywood pieces, but you also go about it, you also do a great job in doing and creating your own works or being a part of it, and they always seem to be human interest pieces or pieces that really talk and speak to the human experience. Could you let me know a little bit why you feel like you have to be like responsible as an artist? Well, I mean, I, I feel, I, this is what I feel. I feel like, you know, if I'm on a get involved in creating my own thing. I want to create stuff that, that have a lot of heart, mm -hmm. have a lot of soul. Characters that go through an emotion, that go through something where they learn something about themselves. Gotcha. So that's why I sort of focus on just a person in a, in a situation. Mm -hmm. Situation that anyone can go through. You know, gotcha. it just makes it more human, wow. Thank more you. universal. My last question for you is, if, some, if you could get advice back in the day that you know right now, what would that be? Back in the day, yeah. ah man, um, good question. Uh, prepare yourself. I mean, prepare yourself, as in really study, study your craft, whatever. If you want to be a carpenter, really study what what it is to uh, hammer a nail, mm -hmm. the right way to hammer a nail. Uh, acting, prepare yourself and learn every little thing you can, because you only get one chance, at one audition, wow. and uh, that chance only comes once. Thank you so much for your Thanks, time, man. Manny. I really appreciate, appreciate it. it. Congratulations on Thank all your you. works, all your success. One last question. I know I already said sure. that. What's next for you? What's going on? Uh, well, I have a, a film that comes out in August called Love is Strange. And then I have this film that premieres tonight. Opens. Uh, it comes out in, the, in HBO in September. And then I'm doing an independent film in New York and another film in the DR and a, in that's what I got cooking. Sounds right good. Now. Sounds yeah, like great. a list, uh, a no, complete a roster thing. of works to have. God thing. bless you. Thank Thanks, you again. Bro. See you God bless you soon. Take, Take care. care.